Hello everyone and welcome to Supreme Commander 2, Episode 3, The Great Leap Forward. Greetings, Dr. Snyder. It's about time you got here. We ran into some trouble on the way. At this moment, I'm less interested in your problems than my own. My facility is under siege and my defenses are proving inadequate. We will provide assistance. I believe I can move the battle away from her facility with my air forces. Indeed. This would also be an excellent test for my jump jet technology. Okie dokie. Oh, sorry, my computer's doing some weird stuff there. You get in there. This might be a bit laggy, guys, because the internet keeps going down. And for some reason, this seems to affect a game that is currently not online and should not be affected by the internet going down. So, I do apologise. There's not much I can do about it, but other than waiting until the internet actually starts working again. And go away. <laughs> wow, the shield went instantly down, really? Okay, so we're going to build one, two, three. Let's make it four. Commander, build that there. And you're going to throw out stuff there. My troops are going to be the last line of defense. Wow, laggy as fuck. I don't quite understand how having no internet seems to affect game performance. Like it's purposely built in. Which is stupid, but... Drop your troop off that. Then come back. Go away, seriously. First of all, build that, then reclaim those. You're gonna grab that. You're gonna go and unload him there, then return. You're gonna go there. Then you're gonna place the next one next to him. This is actually starting to get quite annoying, actually. It'd be nice for things to work properly. Which is a very rare achievement in my house. Things working properly. Ha! What is this? There we go. I managed to catch it in time. Okay, you're going to put that there. No, we're not going to build that. You're going to build me ten of those. You're then going to build me some power generators. And their attacks are going to start picking up, so I seriously need to get down there and uh, sort shit out. And then my computer is opening loads of random things again. You are going to ferry to there. And once you've done that, come. Oh my god, game performance. You're going to go there and put that there. You are going to grab that first, then the shield generator, then the air factory. That says me one thing having to be built. You're going to come there and get ready to jump jet when I research it. Decrease cost build by 5%. Yes, please. Next we need 5, 10. We need 10 points for the next one. Okay, every troop's useful, so get your ass down there. Because the anti-air, I do believe, are on the way now. And... Go away. Stupid messages. The problem with backwards compatibility games on Microsoft consoles. I hate blooming Windows 10 as it is, let alone the system. 
And I do believe that is Anthea. Yes, it is. Okay, come over here, please. And where are my gunships? You're going to come over here as well. Completely abandon the outpost. Regroup everyone. Drop that there. Grab two of these. Drop them in. Go away. And we're going to build five more. All oh, these guys are going to have fun, apparently. Okay, we seriously need to get some troops down there because we are lacking so badly. Doesn't matter about healing him right now, just get these defenses operational. Because we're screwed. Although I think I'll have you come over here and destroy those. Although I actually can't wait, unfortunately. My troops do need the air support, unfortunately. I'll have these four focus on them first. Or well, my gunships focus on annihilating them. They are going to scroll over my air units a bit, but... Not to worry. My air troops, when I've done that, they can go there and patrol. Same with the gunships they can patrol. Okay, that's one successfully defended. We just need to begin construction now. Where is that drop zone? It's right there. Put it there. Got three more. Increase that a bit. We have two more air units, which Ah, great, now they're sending combinations. Although I do like the combination idea, this is not the best time for that kind of attack. Game, will you really stop lagging, please? What we really need is those air units taken out. Because I can't do anything with them there, so once again, my air units have to retreat. Well, my gunships get shredded. Oh, this is really annoying. Damn connection. But we seriously need research points right now, that's what we're lacking. Right, kill those. We'll do our best at defending against these guys. You are gonna pump me out some units. Have them go over there. See, I'm not looking forward to finishing these waves because then they start sending a. Uh oh wow, my aim is getting fucking shredded. They start sending experimentals at you, and I don't have the capacity to deal with that right now. Right, so you're going to transport them there. Oh my god, we have stopped it with a lag game. Jesus. No game should be this laggy. Just because there's no internet connection. Stupid. Quick, retreat before they start firing at your dragonfly. Thank you. Yes, I'm aware we got another connection. Yeah. 
Sometimes I question everything. Bloody uh, Microsoft. Here. Although that is game specific, but you never did that in the 360. Alright, these guys should be moving a little bit, I think. Oh, sorry, did you forget how to build the third turret? Let me try and re rejog your memory and how to build that. Silly game. Okay, let's get my commander down here now, finally. We'll have some build power. But what I need more than anything for defense is a megalith, a nice, good looking megalith. And we can't build one in the corner over here, so I think I will make good use of this space. Come on, lag, there we go. We're gonna need some power. I'm building so horribly here. Well, we're not going to make the best use of this space, but we're going to make some good use of it at least. Get your ass over there. You are going to build me. Three more. Once the game stops lagging, you're gonna be with some more air units. Oh, the experimental is here already. Jesus, I did not see that. I'm aware of that much activity loss. Everyone, focus. Fire the experimental. Great, there's air units inbound as well. When you've destroyed that, retreat the hell away. Well, it didn't do very well. Back. Thank you for the assistance. Why is the Illuminate attacking your facility? These Cretans aren't Illuminate. They call themselves the Royal Guardians. They claim to be supporters or protectors of former Illuminate leader Princess Rianne Burke. Or other such nonsense. I can't be bothered with the politics. Why were they here? They were here for... Oh, this is unacceptable. They hacked into my system and stole my files on Shiva Prime, including my report on its launch sequence. That is most troubling. We have to stop them before they can upload the data. I agree. Prepare your armies for an assault. I have no armies. For any sort of assault. Of a base like that, at least. Ah, oh, they've done something to my camera again. We've got a small facility over there, we should probably destroy it. Oh, there's another uh, air factory there for me. Alright, we're a bit more defended now. With the small attack coming in rather than the big ones. So I will have these units now display out to the front. So grab you guys to come here and destroy those. What's I left of my... yourself to any of the offline factories in the area. Yes, my child. You should capture them with an engineer or your ACU. Thank you, Dr. Snyder. Uh, I will say for the record that I've already captured one of your facilities, so ha, in your face. I can't use anti-air to defend with because they're sending anti-air as countermeasures. They're sending them alone with nothing, but still. How close do I need to be for this? Okay, pretty close. Uh, 17, that should be way more than enough to get the Megalis up and running. Okay, you three are going to sort of hover around that guy. Who is now... Oh, right, you got to build it. I'm going to build a Megalis station there. Can you jump there yet? Yes, you can. <laughs> Imagine if his rockets just ran out and he fell down there somewhere. I'm good, I'm good, I'm fine. Are you there yet, Commander? Good, capture that, that and that. You're gonna build me some megaliths. Mm -hmm. 
Units there, you will build me units there. Oh, lagging again. And now they apparently have air units. To worry, we can sort this out. Oh, seriously, like. All factories to full building. Capabilities. And that line message will go away. We should be fine now, so what I'm going to do is build these on the ramp, followed by a shield, which will protect them, sort of. And here comes an experimental. Now, my commander was prepared to return, but currently he Count was an experimental. Oh, my experimental's done. Okay, you get over here behind the shield so you can do the long range without getting hit. Uh, you two retreat back a little. The rest of you also fall back. Okay, no attack. Anyway, that's what I like to see, it's health is draining. You appear to have frozen construction. That's that down. Our air unit's taking a beating again. I'll we'll grab ten of those. Select there and tell them to go on patrol when they arrive. You'll keep annoying me, but that's fine. And we should be safe to jump that now. Jump jet. No, I'm jump jet. <laughs> okay. Uh, some fresh troops. My commander, who I need to move off the front line before I do anything else. The lag that is astonishingly bad. Okay, okay, here comes new troops. Move those guys there. And that will pester us again. What we'll do is we actually need research more than anything else, so I'll upgrade the armor fully my troops increase their movement speed because that's always useful um upgrade the commander a little bit tell the commanders to reclaim these pointless things engine is still alive We apparently have seemed to have gained some air units. You're going to build me that. Follow. Ah, oh, don't worry. Followed by that. And there's all my land force once again demolished.
The megalith is the only things you can build up. Land forces just get wiped out defending. Do me a favour and grab that wreck. Oh, we got more hostiles inbound. Oh my gosh, game. If you don't stop lagging, seriously, can start this again. And we've lost the shield generator. Because, you know. I'll build a second one there just for SMGs. Right, where is my transport dropping off troops? Okay, we want the troops around about there. Seven, that should be a, a fair boost. We have 13, let's increase these a little bit. Anything else we can get for land units? Nothing really. Tell you what I could do is scout in their base. Come over here, please. And then fly straight over. <laughs> Let's see what they've got. Uh, Megalith, do me a favour and retreat you a little bit closer. Let's see what they've got in their base. Wait for it. It might not even get close enough. Oh, I did get close enough, but I managed to keep some of my forces. Oh, never mind. I lost one. <laughs> I told them to retreat, but it wasn't quick enough. Okay, so you're gonna go build one, repeat build, because I'm tired of doing manual selections. You're gonna repeat build, and one. Actually, for every three you build, build me two of those and one of those. For every three of those, build me two of those and one of those. And for you, for every three of those, build me one of those, one of those, and one of those. Mix the units up a little bit. Oh, wait, where's the stop button? There it is. Okay, let's send what troops we currently have at them. Uh, we didn't make it very far into their base. They have a nuke defense, loads of anti air, very little point defense. Let's have all four megaliths move up. I do believe that's an experimental we're about to face. Can we do anything for the troops? The jump jet technology is a good alternative to transports. Oh yes. Okay, troops retreat, everyone else. Whoa, that's a lot of uh Whoa, that is a lot of anti air there. Jeez, that's a lot of troops. Uh, my air units need to be a little bit closer. Oh. Just a little closer. Oh, I've locked the bloody thing again. Why is it doing that? Crying out loud. There we go. This locks onto a factory at random. Alright, if we move these guys closer, we should be able to hit them from a distance. 
without losing too much of my force. Ah, oh, shut up. We'll get just a few more anti eggs. We actually have. 20 is not a lot, but it's enough. Okay, if you guys want to move forward just a little bit more, that'd be amazing. Oh, great, here comes the big guy. Oh great, here comes everyone. Alright, they should be able to hit them from long range while they're on patrol. Although I apparently have just attracted everyone. Oh god, look at all that coming over. Wipe out. Almost wiped out their front defense and already we have ourselves some reinforcements. Not to mention all this over here. Actually, if you could build the units there, it might allow me to select them a bit easier. Okie dokie units, come on, you can do it. They have cyber factories though, that's what's really annoying. This mission, it's only the start of this mission that's hard once you've managed to successfully defend the facility. The mission is a lot easier. Oh, here comes another experimental. Which means everyone else hang back a little bit. Wait for our experimentals. Keep moving, keep moving, because they've got stupid large amount of those things again. It's an interesting idea, but the the units are so weak. Oh, it's one of those. Okay. Well, we just returned fire. Never mind. Did I build any anti air in here? I don't think I did. Although I think the shield generators come with anti air. I don't remember. It's increased the range of the jump jets a little. I'm always tempted to just jump into the center of that base and see what happens. For the Fabulous! Take out the experimental where we lag like hell. Well, those units I knew were gonna die, but they did very well. Come on in and try that again. Those guys should be right there. I'm gonna build four replacements because we're gonna need them. Uh, hey, I can select everything without selecting the dropship. We have 26 fighters now. That should be enough. We're gonna move the defense a bit forward while keeping some of it still in the base. Increasing our hold over this area. Go away, network connection. Because your flipping network connection keeps screwing with the build menu and getting us stuck, which is not very useful at all. Oh, you see, now it's glitched out that. 
No, we lost the Megalith because we're sitting still. Alright, aim for that point defense and not point defense. Because we need to rid of them. Oh, they're under a shield as well. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. We'll make short work of this base. Okay, we move in a little bit. Just a little bit. We should be able to start annihilating their frontal defenses. Well, having. Oh, come on, game, stop lagging. Some ideal defense. That might be a little bit too far forward, I'm hoping not. But it should give us anti air coverage at least. Uh, we're going to send down this small reinforcement wave. Because we're slowly losing. Um, our Megalith. And this is going to hurt just a little bit. But we should be able to win. Followed by an immediate attack of that engineer. We can't have them building anything. Everything else can stay there. The reinforcement shouldn't be too far behind. You can only do so much to defend. Oh, you're so dead. You're so dead. Oh, 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 good dodge. Although you are going to die. Just keep moving and you'll be fine. Destroy the engineer. Where's my megalith? Oh, it's there. Everything else, except for the megalith. Ah, oh, never mind. Megalith fall back so I can actually select my units because there's no groupings that I'm aware of in this game on the console. You're going to go over there and start making light work of those factories. These Megaliths... Oh, the commander's come down. Although I don't want to destroy that yet because as fun as that is, when the commander dies, the factories release dinosaurs and shit and I don't want to deal with those right now. Yeah, actually powerful. We'll do the factories. No, we won't. We'll do that because it's about to fire on my weakest opponent. Oh, my weakest unit. No, that's not good. Do not let the bomb bouncer hit you. Ah, right, your tails. Alright, what I need now is some reinforcements. And there's two megaliths, so that'll be a brilliant reinforcement. That is, providing I can keep these two alive. Which means destroying the engineers first and worrying about the units next. I need to move forward a little bit so I can get the rest of those. There's plenty for us to shoot at. And the commander, from the look of it, might want to come down and play. No, he's just healing. Okay, how are we doing up here? Well, when the dinosaurs get released, we're going to need all the units we have. Megaliths, you're going to go and join these guys. All the rest of the other units, is 23, are going to make their way up here and probably attract all the air units that are now coming for me. I need to increase that forward a bit because we're about to get bombed the crap out of. Uh, I may just lose my leg and leg yet. Yeah, might. We're back down to three megaliths. Not much I could do about that. Those bombs track. Fire upon the commander everyone. Let's just end the game. 
<laughs> Why not? Oh, we're about to lose our next megalith. Damn tracking bombs. The commander is taking damage. This is good. Uh, I think the commander will survive, though. My units are getting... Oh, they're not getting up tied up as quickly as I thought they were. Well, Commander, it was a pleasure meeting you. You're about to die, but well done. Yes, the Illumina Commander is down. I am. You have become quite skilled in battle. Thank you, Father. I told you I was ready. I don't mean to interrupt this touching family moment, but there's a good chance they were able to successfully transmit the report on Shiva. I agree with Dr. Snyder. We must take action. Yes. We should immediately travel to the Coalition Command Center on Altair 2. Wait a minute. An unknown creature is loose in the Illuminate base. It appears Dr. Snyder was housing some sort of indigenous life form. It just destroyed a building. <laughs> I would like a sample of its DNA for the purposes of study. Fire. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. Everybody fall back. Although the creature is not wearing armor, which means it's a lot easier to defeat, it's still a pain in the ass. Uh, gunships, you just get down here and patrol. I will ready the troops. Bring them right within uh, firing range. I might be going a bit over the top here for one dinosaur, but they're stupidly strong. Well, they're still somewhat operational in their base. Although I thought two dinosaurs were released, but apparently not. So technically speaking, I could have actually captured this and built Megalith straight into the back of their base, but... Dinosaur is approaching. Megaliths are ready. Or as ready as they're ever going to be, at least. 31 units will be on the front line. The rest of these units will join them. We don't need this much defense, but it'll do anyway for a spectacular show. Uh, they still have air units themselves up. And now let's hit it all at once. This should be interesting. Although my units are going to get wiped out, but... Ah, not to worry. Moves around the beast. It has regening health as well, which is why it's a lot harder. And the dinosaur just got absolutely down. Oh, an experimental came in behind it. Thank you, my child. I shall greatly value this glorious creature's DNA samples. Can we go to Altair 2 now? Yes. We can use its gate to return to Seraphim 7 and the Eco Synthesizer. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then thumbs up. If you didn't, then thumbs down and tell me why. Because, you know, I can't improve if you don't. And, wow, my time was shocking. I definitely could have done that faster, yes. Anyway guys, thanks for joining.